in the nervous system, what this means is that dopamine release changes the probability that certain neural circuits will be active and that other neural circuits will be inactive. Okay. So it modulates a bunch of things all at once. And that's why it's so powerful at shifting, not just our levels of energy, but also our mindset, also our feelings of whether or not we can or cannot accomplish something. So how does dopamine work and what does it do? Well, first of all, it is not just responsible for pleasure. It is responsible for motivation and drive primarily at the psychological level, also for craving. Those three things are sort of the same, motivation, drive, and craving. It also controls time perception. And we will get deep into how dopamine can modulate time perception and how important it is that everybody be able to access increases in dopamine at different time scales. This turns out to be important to not end up addicted to substances, but it also turns out to be very important to sustain effort and be a happy person over long periods of time, which I think most everybody wants. It certainly is adaptive in life to be able to do that. Dopamine is also vitally important for movement. I'll explain the neural circuits for dopamine and mindset and dopamine in movement in a moment, but in diseases like Parkinson's, or Louis's body's dementia, which is similar to Parkinson's in many ways, there is a depletion or death of dopamine neurons at a particular location in the brain, which leads to shaky movements, challenges in speaking, challenges in particular in initiating movement. And because dopamine is depleted elsewhere too, people with Parkinson's and Louis's, and Louis, excuse me, Louis body dementia also experience drops in motivation and affect, meaning mood, they tend to get depressed and so on. When those people are properly treated, they can, not always, but they can recover some fluidity of movement, some ability to initiate movement and almost without question, those people feel better psychologically, not just because they can move, but also because dopamine impacts mood and motivation.